You've created your account and set up your website in Google Builder. Let's start building a page. Remember that if you can't figure something out in Google Builder, just click on the help button. You get instant access to video tutorials, our FAQs, and you can also have a live support chat with one of our great support staff. Let's create a page using drag and drop layout blocks. The layout blocks give you the basics for your page. You have a title, subtitle, paragraph, separator, and image blocks. It's this easy. Grab the block you want and drag it to the page. To change the content, either click on the pencil icon or double click the block. Enter your content, in this case it's my title page, and click on the save button. Now I need a paragraph. Grab it, drag it, double click it, and add your content. With paragraph content, you can select your text and apply style formatting, like bold, italicize, underline, and you can also add a URL link. When you finish editing, don't forget to click the save icon. I'm going to quickly add a few more blocks and some content. Now I need a few images. Drag the single image layout block onto the page and click the camera icon to insert an image. With Google Builder you have three image options. You can upload an image, you can use an existing image, or you can grab an image from the web. To upload an image, click on the upload image icon. Select your image from your local drive and click select. Google Builder will automatically insert the image. It's best to resize your image before uploading, and your file must be less than 2 megabytes. Let's add another one. Click the existing image icon to insert an image that you've already uploaded. Click on the image you want to use, and again, Google Builder will automatically insert the image. To add an image from another website, click on the external image icon, and paste the URL into the field. You must confirm that you have permission to use this image, and then click on the Insert Image button. Let's say you need to move your layout around. Just mouse over the block, click on the drag bar, and drag it to a new position. And to remove a block, just click on the garbage can. That's on the right side of the block. And then confirm that you want to remove it. So. Now you have the basics and you can have some fun creating your layout.